Oh, hello. You may notice that this is a bit of a different intro to my videos typically, and that would be because when recording this week's show, The Almost Awesome Show, episode 33, I, like an idiot, did not record my guests' voices. That's right. I got video of them, and I had two guests this week, but no audio. So you're going to see possibly a little bit of a disjointed video. I tried to limit it as much as possible, make it as cohesive as I could with what I had to work with so that the video and the story still gets out to you. But if you hear me reference another person that does not seem to be there, that's because there were two other people there, actually. Triv from Trivial Theater and Nick from Movie Emporium. But unfortunately, I was unable to include their footage because my dumb ass didn't flip a switch. But I do hope that even with those omissions, you still do enjoy this week's videos. And also, check out Triv's channel, Trivial Theater, and Nick's channel, Movie Emporium, when you get a chance. And of course, check out the Almost Awesome show that goes live every Wednesday afternoon at 2 p.m. Central Time. And with that, on with the show or at least the part that I recorded. Westworld has been canceled after four seasons, four, glor I guess, glorious seasons. Um, me, myself, I've only seen the first two seasons and just a smidgen of season three, not because there's anything wrong with it, I just didn't finish it. I planned on actually real soon getting back into it in, because I'd heard season four was really good. And I was looking forward to the forthcoming fifth season, but not happening. So we're only getting this one. Let's see what they got to say about it. Announcement came nearly three months after season four final, but as recently as last month, co-showrunner Jonathan Jonah Nolan told Deadline that the show was still in discussions of returning. We had always conceived of a fifth and final season, he said. We're still in conversations with the network's co-creator Lisa Joy echoed the sentiments and indicated the series had a planned conclusion. Jonah and I had always had an ending in mind that we hope to reach, she said. We have, uh, we have not quite reached yet. Unfortunately, but not surprisingly, it seems those conversations brought the series to its end. Their viewership has been going down since season two. And it, Westworld earned 54 Emmys overall during its run, but it has now been canceled and is not getting that fifth season. Season four of Westworld saw the return of star-studded veteran cast members Evan Rachel Wood, Ed Harris, Tessa Thompson, uh, Sandy Newton, Jeffrey Wright, Luke Hemsworth, James Marsden, yada, 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 yada. Aaron Paul's on it? I didn't know that. Um, lots of people. And it was historically been one of the most expensive shows for the network. Over the past four seasons, Lisa and Jonah have taken viewers on a mind-bending odyssey, raising the bar at every step. We are tremendously grateful to them, along with their immensely talented cast, producers and crew, and all the partners at Killer Films, Bad Robot, and, Robot, and Warner Brothers Television. It's been a thrill to join them on this journey. But it is a journey that is not going to see an ending. I liked Westworld. I like. I, it had not started to like... Uh, go down in quality for me, but I hadn't seen season three, so I was, I'm, I'm, un, I, I can't speak to the quality of what happened after what I've seen, but I mean, I was really digging it, and I was really looking forward to watching more, and I enjoyed it, but, I mean, you can't deny the numbers. It does show. I'm looking at all the numbers, how it just, it's just going down in viewership every season. So, I mean, it's one of those unfortunate things where I understand why they did it, but that doesn't mean I have to like it. Once again, can't comment on three and four, but. One and two were really creative. Uh, they kind of drug out this like center thing from what I remember the map or something. They drug this whole situation out the whole show, which is that's what shows do. But I was I really enjoyed the show. So this does kind of suck in my opinion. But once again, I get it. I'm still going to watch season three and four because I've heard, I've heard good things about season four. Season three, I've heard mixed things, but I haven't heard anybody just say it was terrible. So I am looking forward to it. This does suck. Uh, but what about you guys out there? Do we have any Westworld fans in the comments? Are you saddened by this? Do you understand it? Once again, like I said, I'm saddened by it, but I get it. I mean, looking at the numbers, they can't be denied. It does have quite the decline over the seasons as it went on. And like we were talking about with Avatar, these shows, just like movies, they are, while it is an art form, they're a business also. And the, the business guys are there to do their job and their job is to make sure that they're making money off of these things. And if they're not, they gotta cut their losses and that sucks that sucks because i really enjoyed this show but i 
I get it at the same time. It's a, it's a tough pill to swallow. But you guys out there, let us know in the comments below what you thought or what you think. Were you looking forward to season five? Um, are you saddened by the cancellation of the show? Did you ever even watch Westworld? And what did you think about all of that?